uh, here's a good example of a, uh, a 20 piece uh, XL kit and a bridge kit combined. Um, you're going to end up with 20 pieces from the XL kit and then six pieces from the bridge. Um, the bridge is these um, ones right here. In this in this lineup, you've got your flat rock, this very steep, uh, approximately 40 to 5 to 50 degree ramp on that side. Um, these plates here just lift out and you can swap out the, the other plate here um, to come up and put up here where this one here you kind of have to squeeze between where this one you're ended up hanging off the uh, edges here uh, instead so you're having to go around by that direction where you're going to end up high centered sitting up on top of it so it's it's, it's definitely a uh, hang off the edge kind of a fun little uh, one there and like I said this one here is extremely uh, extremely steep and fairly hard to make it up all these tiles can get swapped out um, you can take uh, this tile out and put one of the uh, other side tiles uh, up in there instead if you wanted to make things more difficult um, or easier um, in there and so the couple of loose rocks you get here come with it as well. Uh, these rocks actually snap together um, here and you can run them as two separate pieces or uh, clip together. These two kind of things are cool for putting in like a crack over here. Um, you can stick something like that in there so that you don't have such a big gap to crawl over. Um, if any of the tiles don't line up well together. So there's definitely got a lot of options um, that direction. And then if the the rocks split open, these tabs can pop out of here as well. Um, and you can run them separately. bridge just sets down on there and all these tiles all clip together here with these little tabs which then you can turn it around in any direction that you want to just will make it either easier or more difficult. There's a lot of different shapes and arrangements to go with it here. So a lot of versatility 